Hi there. Hey, first day, huh? Uh, no. I've worked here for a while. Sorry, I'm on my Bluetooth. That's great, Rob. First day jitters, I bet? Ha! Ah. What's the special today? Fresh stromboli. Ugh, what else you got? Me? Yes. Iceberg wedge salad. I'll have that. Great. Let me just chop some lettuce. <gasps> Whoa, sorry, Rob. I've got to go. Gloria, are you okay? First things first, size up the scene and form an initial impression. Notice anything here? That's right. The knife that Gloria dropped is now a potential hazard. Now that you've checked the scene and identified all potential hazards, it's time to send Paul, the bystander, to call 911 and get the first aid kit. Yeah, I'll go call right now. Before you begin treating the wound, obtain consent from Gloria. Explain who you are, what you see, what you plan to do, and ask if you can help. Yes, please help me. I don't know how I did this. Now, you're ready to begin providing care. First, apply pressure using a dressing. Once the bleeding stops, wrap the wound in dressing with a roller bandage. Tie the bandage knot directly over the wound. This keeps more pressure on the wound even after it's wrapped. Monitor Gloria, ask her how she's feeling, and observe her closely for signs of shock. I feel weak and dizzy. Oh no, it looks like Gloria is going into shock. Carefully, lay her flat on the floor and cover her with a blanket. Make sure to offer reassurance and continue to monitor Gloria until help arrives.